plans here. Um, I have a planner haul for you guys today. I have been picking up fall and holiday items lately and I wanted to do a video to show you guys the stuff I have been getting. I'm going to start with um, these sticker books. These are from Michaels and they are a dollar each. I found a whole bunch so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the different ones that I have. I'm going to start with a Happy Haunting sticker book. Um, this is your basic um, cats, pumpkins, ghosts, witches kind of sticker book. Um, it says Happy Halloween. There's some spiders and some owls. Um, I tend to like more stickers that are like your typical basic holiday type stickers. Um, so I really like this book in particular. And then this is the Freaky Fountain one and it has some different like yucky drinks and eyes in jars and some little, I don't know, witches and creatures and stuff like that. So then it's got the pages in the different colors. Here's like the beige color and the blue and it's like the same stickers in like different orders, um, just kind of repeated and then I got the Spooky Pumpkin. I think this one's my favorite. I really like um, just all the plain pumpkins. Uh, what I'm going to do actually is use these plain ones for the Halloween countdown in my planner. And then there's some with faces. Um, it's just all pumpkins. So there's that one. This is the Movie Mayhem one. And it has um, like popcorn stands, some pumpkins, ghosts like different movie stuff. Um, this girl is like a movie theater worker with popcorn and the witch with her cauldron. And this one is pretty cute, I think, to mark like movie nights in October. Um, it's not my favorite. Like I said, I like more like just plain Halloween stuff, but I picked it up. I thought it would be cute um, if we watch the Halloween movies um, to mark in my planner. Okay, so then I found these Thanksgiving ones and I grabbed a couple of these. Um, this one is really, really cute. It's got all these little animals, and they have these big old blue eyes. And these are like owls and turkeys and different birds and trees. Up here there's a turtle and a fox and a raccoon and like a bird, a little baby turkey. And then this has all the feathers. This one is called the tribal turkey, and I thought this one was really, really cute. Um, there's some pumpkins and little um, horns of plenties and... So there's that one, and then this one is the Fall Friends sticker book, and this is another one that is super duper cute to me. It's got these big old fat turkeys and some foxes, some different animals. Um, just your basic Thanksgiving stickers. These are really cute. I love these little animals. They're so like happy and cute. This one is called the Plaid Pumpkin. It's got some more animals with these big old eyes. It is super cute. It also has some trees, leaves, and apples. So there's the different pages of that. Oh, look how cute the little mouse. Oh, look at the little eyes. I just think this is so cute. I really, really like this one. Oh, look at the foxes. Hello, pumpkin. I like this book a lot. My daughter's over here. She's like, gimme, gimme, gimme. This one is the Turkey Blessings book, and it has more of these characters <laughs> with the big eyes. This one has um, like pumpkins and squash, leaves, acorns, turkeys. Uh, this one is so cute. I just really like these big old eyes on these um, Thanksgiving books. I think I like the Thanksgiving ones a little bit more than the Halloween ones, but... I was really happy that I found these. Um, I was on the hunt for Christmas ones, and this is the only Christmas one I found, and um, they just said they hadn't put them out yet, so I probably will be able to find them when I go back. Um, I honestly am not going to use, like, Disney characters in my planner, probably unless we go to Disney World, but um, I got these for my daughter because she loves Mickey Mouse, so I actually picked up a couple different books for her, but anyways, this is really cute. You know, it's got Mickey, Minnie, Goofy, Donald Duck, Pluto, um, and just holiday colors, holiday themes. Um, I do like that it's got like ornaments and snowflakes and candy canes and different other things that I probably would use. 
Um, so I got that one. And then this one is just a random different one that I found. It's called Glitterville. And um, it's got some different animals, some snails. It's like really fun, bright spring colors. And I'm probably gonna be saving this for when spring comes back around. But I thought it was really cute, so I picked it up. And there's all the pages in that. These little turtles are so cute. It's got these little mushroom houses. This one's pretty fun. I like this one a lot. So that's it for the sticker books that I picked up. And I probably got more than I need, but I'm kind of anxious for the Christmas ones. I saw a couple of people picked them up already, and I was kind of bummed out that I couldn't um, get any of those. But yeah. So the next thing I want to show you guys is my Halloween washi that I picked up. I also got these at Michael's and I think they're Recollections brand if I remember correctly and they came in like sets of two. Um, I can't remember how much they were though, a couple bucks. And um, yeah, so I just got, this one is pumpkins with polka dots and then the spider web one. And this one says boo and it's got spiders another pumpkin one but this one is plain without polka dots this is black with orange polka dots I really like polka dots this is really cute and then this has is white with black and orange polka dots and then this is um, white with bats but what I like about this one is it's kind of clear like I used it on my monthly spread oops and I like that it's like kind of see-through ish when you lay it down so I don't know if you can see that, but I like how that, I think that looks really, really cool. I like that. So yeah, there's that one. And then the last one I have here is this one. It says boo and it's got like orange, green, and white. So I thought these were really cute. I'm really happy with these. Okay, so the next holiday stuff I grabbed was from the Dollar Spot at Target. Um, I only picked up these two notebooks because this was the only like pattern print holiday stuff that I liked that they had. They had a lot of other um, Halloween patterns and I just didn't care for any of them. And I also have a ton of these kind of Dollar Spot notebooks and I didn't need that many more, but I wanted some to decorate my planner with for October. So I got these, and as you can see, I've already opened them and started using them. Honestly, the sticky pads are not the greatest. They're not super sticky, but um, I just use double-sided tape, and um, if I want to leave it in my planner, that's what I use. And then this has a magnet on it, so you can stick it on your refrigerator and make lists or whatever. And I just thought these were really cute, so I got those. Then also from the dollar spot, I got these page flags. Um, I think this is the new line. It's like geometric triangles, but these are really bright, like springtime colors, and they're really, really pretty. So I was really glad that I found them. I only found the one package. They only had this one, and so I was really happy I was able to pick it up. Then I also grabbed this accordion folder. Um, I've seen a lot of people do sticker organizing with these and um, it has tons of pockets in here. It was only a dollar, so obviously it's a little bit like flimsy, but I thought this pattern was really pretty. And what I'm probably gonna do is, because I use a binder to organize my stickers and I really love the way that's working for me. So I'm probably just gonna use this for, um, to put in what I'm gonna use that week. So I have it all in one spot and I don't have to pull it out of my binder. So I'm gonna see if I like doing that. But um, yeah, so I got that from the dollar spot at Target as well. I also got these at Target, but they obviously are not in the dollar spot. These are the Stedler Tri Plus Fine Liner Pins. Um, I tried the other Stedler pins that were, I can't remember what they were called, but these are more like a Sharpie almost. And I really love them. I've already started using one in my planner and I really, really like how these write. I usually use um, the Ultra Fine Sharpie, but even that's kind of thick. So I like that these are a little bit thinner than the Sharpie. It makes my writing a little nicer. And um, they write really well on glossy stickers. They do not write well on the Libby and Co stickers. And I use tons of Libby and Co stickers. I still have to use a Sharpie on those because this won't dry. Okay, and then the last thing I want to show you guys is this pencil pouch that I found. They had all the back to school items 
in one little area and it was all marked down on clearance. It was right behind all the Halloween stuff that they just put out. And this was um, originally six something and it was on sale for like a dollar something. So I grabbed it, I thought it was really cute. They had like um, pink glitter, gold glitter, silver glitter, and then this one I think. And they had a ton of them and I just grabbed this one. I thought this would be really cute to keep um, my pens in and keep it next to my planner so that it would be easy for me to just um, grab stuff. I have a Kipling and it can get a little bit bulky to have laying around the counter. So I thought this was really cute and I love it. Okay guys, so that's going to be it for this planner haul. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you would like to see more from me. And thank you guys for watching. I'll talk to you next time. Bye.